What's going on team? Rick with BTR here today. So what we're gonna talk to you about is a little bit of dry firing. So what I want you guys to see before we go into this, uh, I got this information from a buddy of mine on uh, Instagram, Gamage. Uh, go search for him, Gamage, rhymes with damage. Um, look him up, has great things on his uh, page and he teaches a lot. So one of the things that he helped me out with was this for dry firing. And what this is, is it's a nine mil replica laser that when the uh, firing pin hits it, it makes a little red dot. I don't know if I got you on that. Let me see if I get you. All right. So every time you hit the firing pin, it makes a red laser. And one of the other things he told me to grab was this. It's called the laser light. So here it is, laser light. It has a total of two settings, one setting with sound, one setting without sound. So one of the things with this laser light that's awesome is, we'll go, I'll show you real quick right now. So here it does that with the sound. And then without the sound, it just, just shows up as a mark like that. One of the great things too, it's not fairly expensive. You're not wasting uh, money on ammo, things like that. So on Amazon, I got two of these right under $100. And for this, uh, I believe it was right under $40. But you could dry fire all night long, um, all day, get your trigger squeeze, excellent, so on and so forth. So I'm going to use my Glock 19 and show you guys how to put it on. So as you can see, there's these rubber, I guess... Uh, I don't know what you would really call them, but the rubber. So when you insert the, the uh, laser into the barrel, you gotta make sure you push it down. And then once you get it down, make sure it's cocked. So I don't know if I'll be able to do it. Let's see, hopefully it's close. And then once you get the trigger, this is what will happen. So you could dry fire, get it going. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get this set up and then I'm gonna show you guys an example how to do this. All right team, so I got the laser and the Glock 19 and I got the laser light right on the mantle, uh, right below the TV. One thing I love about having it right there is when I'm watching TV during commercial breaks, I could be sitting on the couch, stand up and just practicing dry fryer from there. So I have my holster here, my Glock here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put the holster inside my waistband and then what I'm gonna do is practice pulling it out, getting a good target and shooting. So I'm gonna demonstrate that right now. See, and that's what it's gonna do. It's gonna make a noise like that. Um, so I'll show it one more time. Uh, put the weapon back and just practice it all the time. Um, I usually do it roughly 20, 30 minutes a day um, on commercials if I'm not doing anything, so on and so forth. So I'll do it one more time. Here we go. So, whoop. Oh, can't find the light. Oh, there it is. And then when you get good at it, just bring it here, get a good side picture, shoot it, shoot it. And then sometimes when you miss, it's okay. It's just making sure you get that good sight picture. Make sure you charge the weapon after every single time. Practice makes perfect. Um, and remember, we're not going for long range on this. If we're using our weapon and it, it's for short range, anywhere from 10 to 12 feet. So stay right there, keep practicing, and please subscribe, follow, like, BTR and I uh, don't want to forget Gamage. Thank you so much for all the info on this for me to get better and I'm just trying to pass it along for everybody else to get better. Again, please subscribe, like, and subscribe to BTR. We'll get another film out here shortly for you guys. Appreciate you.